The Equal Protection Clause of the 14th Amendment prohibits states from enacting laws that treat certain classes of people differently. For example, a state law can't fine women more than men for speeding. But can a state statute police conduct of only certain classes as long as that statute punishes those targeted classes equally? The United States Supreme Court addressed this question in McLaughlin v. Florida. A Florida statute banned a white person and a black person of opposite sexes from regularly sharing a room at night if they weren't married to each other. Those who violated the statute, whether black or white, spent up to 12 months in jail and paid up to $500 in fines. Florida had no statute prohibiting couples of the same race or other race combinations from such cohabitation. Other statutes in the same chapter prohibited extramarital and premarital sex and applied generally regardless of race. In 1962, Dewey McLaughlin, a black man, and Connie Hoffman, a white woman, were charged with violating the interracial cohabitation statute. At trial, McLaughlin and Hoffman argued that the statute violated their 14th Amendment right to equal protection under the law. The judge overruled their challenge, and the jury convicted them. The Florida Supreme Court subsequently affirmed the conviction and upheld the statute as constitutional because it punished black and white people equally. McLaughlin and Hoffman then appealed to the United States Supreme Court.